Hey, Mike out here at the shop. Today we're going to put the workshop to a real test. We know it can sharpen knives, but can it sharpen a hand scythe? Oh, listen to me. If it can sharpen this with all of this compound geometry on here, we'll know we really have a winner. Hang with me. We're going to do it right now. This is a hand scythe that I've had for years and I've never been able to sharpen it very good. So let's see how the work sharp does. First thing I'll do is I'll take this guide off, get that out of the way. I'll go ahead and flip that down. Then I'll mash my lever and roll this over until it gets into that position. Then I'll look at my angle and see that I've got it right. And then we'll go to sharpening. I tell you what, that's doing a good job. I'm gonna finish up, that's the coarse belt. I'm gonna finish up with the medium belt and then with the buffing belt. And I'm gonna put it on time lapse so I don't bore you to death with the whole time that it took to do this. So now we've worked on it with all three belts. We've got it scary sharp. Got a little piece of hardened bamboo here. Let's see what she'll do. Just look at it. Peel that curl off. No problem at all. Matter of fact, I think I could sit here and work and work this just like some type of a woodworking tool to flatten this curve of this bamboo out. It's pretty awesome. A wonderful, wonderful edge put on there by that work sharp. So very glad I purchased this thing. It's been a good unit. This is the one that I purchased. And this is the least expensive version of this. You can get the Ken Onion version, which has even more features on it. But I tell you, for the money, I don't think you can beat the WorkSharp original. It's a fine unit. If you struggle with sharpening things, don't struggle anymore. Go buy a WorkSharp. You can look behind me here. And just hanging on the wall, you can see several items that could possibly use a little touch from the work sharp. But I guarantee you over the coming months, I'm gonna be using this thing and shooting videos about everything that it can do. And I'll look for you to probably end up purchasing one yourself. If you don't, it's because you already got one.